Pac-Man, Donkey Kong, Street Fighter, and so much more. This vintage event is every gamer's dream. WDRB photojournalist Brian Manuel immerses us into the golden era of gaming at this year's Louisville Arcade Expo. Louisville Arcade Expo. It's the 13th year. I've been coming here the last couple of years and you know it's always fun. How many lives do I have? I got a callus on my finger and my shoulders hurting too. I literally came up with the earliest of games. I was born in 72. I probably played more Galaga than anything. My favorite game, I have to go old school, I have to go Pac-Man. hanging out at Rec Bar about three years ago and um, actually we hung out there about six months and never even played a game. Then we went into the pinball room and it's been, I, I don't know, it's been a rabbit hole. We've been vending here for two years and had a blast. It's perfect, you know, anything, you know, anything kids, pop culture, uh, people of all ages, reminiscent of them stuff, so, you know, it's growing up. Man, everybody's cool. Just going on the couch, looking up pinball machines and seeing this and my results. And I was like, oh, I gotta come here, I gotta come here. A lot of these people are my age, a little older, a little younger. Actually, there's all age groups, but I think not only does it bring people together, it's just nostalgic. And if you get new people or younger people that are into this kind of stuff, you know, it just brings a whole nother level. 